Hey guys, it's Expertos here. Today we are starting the new Nmap series in which I'm gonna teach you about the Nmap, like what Nmap is, how to use it and why we need to use it. Before we even start, this is important that only scan system or network that you own or have at least written permission to test it because um, scanning the random um, network or website is illegal. Alright, so what actually NMAP is, NMAP stands for the Network Mapper. Think of it like it is a digital radar for the network, which pings around and tells tells you um, who's online, um, I mean which hosts are online, which ports are open, and what kind of service might be running behind them. Um, it's uh, one of the first tool that every pen tester learns because um, it is fast, reliable, flexible and super powerful once you know how to use it. So um, if you are using the Kali Linux Parrot OS or any security focused distro, the Nmap will be pre-installed in your system. Um, to download it, we will just um, visit nmap.org and hit the download section. Here we can see it is available for the almost all operating systems like the Windows, Mac OS and Linux. So um, in our case, we have already installed the Nmap to test that if you have installed or not, we'll just type Nmap dash dash version. Um, if it prints the version number, it means that you have installed the Nmap already. In case if you don't have installed, we will just type sudo apt update and then sudo apt install dash y nmap, which will um, install the nmap in our system. So now we have installed it. Um, so the first thing we are gonna do is um, type nmap dash dash help. Um, which you can think it is the uh, manual of nmap uh, which has the uh, commands and uh, parameters that we will use in the future. Now um, scroll down all to the bottom we have example section which we will focus today on this video. Um, so let me explain you the parameters that uh, have in the commands. Okay, so let's focus on the first command that we have right here. Uh, dash V is used for the verbose, which basically prints uh, the information and the progress that is running while scan the any network or website. So you can actually know what's happening behind the scenes. Uh, the dash A is stand for the aggressive, which is the bundle of the uh, OS detection, version detection, uh, and the trace route. So, and after that, we have our target, which is scanme.nmap.org, uh, which is the website provided by the Nmap itself, which uh, says uh, hello and welcome to scanme.nmap.org. It is the services service provided by the uh, Nmap. We have set up this machine to help folks learn about the Nmap and also test and make sure that the Nmap installation for the internet connection is working properly. You are authorized to scan this machine with the Nmap or any other port scanner. Try not to hammer on the server too hard, a few scan in the day is fine, but do not scan 100 times a day. Or use this site to brute force or password or any cracking tool. That is what I mean when I said you need a written permission to test any website or network. Okay, so let's, let's focus on the third command that we have right here. Uh, the dash IR is used for uh, picking the random uh, addresses in the network. So we have provided the value 10,000, so it will pick the random 10,000 hosts uh, in the network. So dash pn is used for uh, directly assume it it directly assumes that the or host are online. So it will not waste the time by scanning uh, and pinging the hosts. And we have specified the port number 80 by the dash p, which is the which basically does is uh, it will scan only port number 80 and it will not look for any other port. So let me just uh, explain the 
uh, output that you might get by uh, running the first command, you can see uh, a few lines uh, which is printed here, which is the verbose. I mean, it's, it's basically tells you what's happening. Like uh, it discovered the port, it's scanning the nmap.org website, and so on and so forth. So uh, if you scroll down a little bit, uh, you can see uh, what types of ports are running, like the port number 22 is opened uh, on the host. So for example, you can see here port number 22 is running the serv service SSH with the version open SSH 6.6.1. And uh, same for the port number 80, it's running the HTTP, which is uh, Apache HTTPD 2.4.7. And we can even see the OS version, which is likely the Linux. Uh, here you can see uh, aggressive OS guess is uh, Linux 4.19. So, and then we have the trace root here printed. So, uh, trace root is the basically a path that packet, uh, uses for travel to our destination. Um, so, so that's it for the today's video. Uh, we have covered what nmap is, a few basic commands for the beginners, and, uh, I suggest you to look for the uh, nmap manual by typing the nmap dash dash help and try the few commands here. If this video helped you then smash the like button, drop a comment and don't forget to subscribe. And uh, you can also follow me on Instagram. That's it for today. Peace.